Hey everybody, it's Faith from Firesign Tarot. Hope everyone is well. <sighs> okay, Aries. The universe has decided that it is now your turn. So, we're going to get it going. I'm going to tip down. We're going to get started. Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, all the Spirit, Spirit Guides, Archangels, thank you so much for joining me again this evening. Please give me the clarity of mind and the peace of heart to bring Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus to their highest good and put them on their highest path. Thank you for blessing me. Please allow me and help me to spread these blessings to Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Oh. Hi, Orphaned. Okay. There are no accidents at this table. So we'll pull one to go. I didn't see it. Orphaned, number five. Five is transitions. A sense of loss, an identity crisis, recognizing that you don't fit in, they need to belong, uncertainty about your place. Okay? We were all meant to have connections with other people within our families, society, and the larger culture. No man is an island. It's important to recognize when being a part of rather than separate from is essential to your well-being. The issue at hand is the need to find where you fit. Be true to your core truths and values. Perhaps you no longer identify with a group or community the way you did before and need to find a new situation. You might be feeling a deep sense of loss or confusion address the need for belonging and know that you will find your place with others of like mind and spirit. It's okay to let go of pressure to fit in. Not everyone will understand you. It's time to move on. Okay. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Oh my, well. No. Source says no, you had it right the first time. Seven cups reversed. Hmm. Okay, ten pentacles reversed, ten swords reversed, ace of cups, six pentacles reversed, eight pentacles reversed, seven cups reversed overall, orphaned.
confusion. No choice cards have come up, so you're just confused. We'll address that in a minute. Yes, I peeked. All right. Why is Ten Pentacles reversed here? Sorts. Good grief, Aries, really going to make me work for it tonight, aren't you? Are you gonna make me work for it tonight? There it is. Things are out of balance. Smoke and mirrors, choppy waters. Why three pentacles? Four of wands. Making plans for happiness. There's something unknown. I feel like des somebody desperately tried to hold a tower up. Why is the Ten of Swords reversed here? Let's fight in a painful ending. King of Wands reversed. Nine rods. Two cups. King of cups reverse. You got two upside down kings here. The love is gone. The passion is gone. But you're still fighting for the connection. You're still fighting the ending. You fought it. To no avail. Seven rods reversed. To no avail. That's the losing of the internal battle. Good grief. Well, here's the good news. There's an ace of cups. There's at least one cup on the shelf that looks good. You're just not sure which path to take. <clears throat> You're still coming down off of whatever the hell this was. Ace of Pentacles. That's promising. Mm, page of Wands. Not too talkative. Barely talkative. Could be another fire sign you're dealing with. Three wands. It's not time yet. Wheel of Fortune in the upright. All in due time. All in due time.
This speaks of destiny, endings, and beginnings. Something has to end. Something isn't quite over yet. Even if it's over and the papers are signed and the ink is dry, something isn't over because it's not over in here, in your heart or in your head. Because you're still confused as to what the hell happened. Okay, well, one more. Five of Swords. Five of Swords. Reversed, even. You're still standing on the battlefield. For me, this is a card of when two people just kind of, okay, you go your way, I go mine. But it's this way. Somebody's still standing there. All right, talk about six pentacles reversed in the future. Four swords laying it to rest. Finally putting the last nail in the coffin. The sun, letting the sun come out again. Seven pentacles not waiting around anymore. Seven pentacles reversed. Realizing it's never going to be equal and it's never going to hurt. Hanged man. Finally seeing things from a new perspective. Six rods at the bottom of the deck. Victory. Why is the Eight of Pentacles reversed too? Queen of Rods upright. Page of Swords. Four cups reversed, eight swords. Really? Eight swords at the bottom of the deck? So you're going to stop investing in this and stop waiting on this, but... I don't see you totally investing in the next one either. you ignoring the cup that's being handed to you. I see communication. I don't see investment. I don't see putting in the work. I don't see... I see you ignoring a cup. Page of Pentacles. Taking it slow. Okay. That makes sense. Magician. Allowing things to manifest in due time. Very nice. Well done. Well done. What's underneath there? The world. Ah... <sighs> Finally making a decision. Oh, yeah, there's the choice card. There we go. There it is. Mm, I don't like the option, though. I don't like seven swords. It is reversed, though, so. Could it be a return? I don't know. I don't think it plays into the reading. I think it just picked up one too many cards. Cheers, take it. Seven cups of verse, three rods of verse. There we go. Okay. Eight swords. Don't allow this to consume you. You gotta come out of the cold eventually. Devil reversed, nine swords reversed, three wands reversed.
eventually you got to walk away from that dock and stop dwelling on it because that's what's keeping you bound. I understand that transitions are scary and not knowing your place is scary, but being bound in a situation where you don't belong anymore, that's frightening. Blessed, number 22. <clears throat> something wonderful that is unearned or unexpected grace that is an unforeseen gift from spirit there are moments in life when out of the blue it seems that everything has been orchestrated by divine intervention you feel blessed in ways that are difficult to express. It's as if the Red Sea parts in front of you and events come together to banish your troubles easily and naturally. You know deep down you did not deserve any of it. And yet here you are. This is one of those times. Let awe and gratitude for all your blessings guide you now. Some good came out of this. I don't know what that is. It's not my story. I just threw down some cards. But you know what it is. So you got to find the blessing. All right, Aries. Fire! Know that you love to be blessed. I will catch you next time. Take care.